So my name is Destiny Caro. Um, my pronouns are he, him, his, and they, them, theirs. Um, I'm a fifth year human services major and queer studies minor, ASI director for the College of Health and Human Development. Um, I also work at the LGBTQ Resource Center as the Identity Development Programs Lead. Um, so like doing advocacy around trans, um, trans rights. Specifically, I do things around like uh, tr for trans students, since I am a trans student myself, I um, work toward doing advocacy and for like within student affairs. Uh, when I know what it's I, that it can be difficult um, being out or not out as a trans person, um, having to correct other people um, when they misgender you, or not correcting people because you just don't have the capacity to. What trans means. Um, like Someone who doesn't identify with the sex they were assigned at birth. So, like, I was assigned female at birth. I didn't really know I was trans for most of my life. Uh, cause I didn't even know that even existed at all. I just knew that I was just really comfortable with being labeled as a girl. I came out to myself about being, you know, trans. And actually, I think I, for my head, I was saying it for such a long time, like, I think I am, I think I'm trans. Is that until like I was by myself in my room one day and like I am trans, I'm trans, and I had to say it to myself because I never said it out loud and I didn't think how to make it real, and then it's when it came more real to me. I cried for a good sec because I didn't want to be trans. I didn't want that to happen. I didn't want that for for myself because I knew what it was like and reading what it was like to be trans. And then also realizing that, like, for most of my, like, life, I didn't know trans people existed. So then I felt like I didn't exist. My mom was not happy about me coming out. Um, she still to is this day in complete denial. Every time she gives me clothing, like, literally, like, right after, she'd be like, you look like a pretty girl. You look so good, daughter. You look such a cute, you look so, I'm just, all these gendered words, like, she says them, um, like, so purposefully, and it just makes me so upset. Like, why do you say these words to me, knowing, n knowing how much it's going to hurt me? Why would you say these things to me? It just doesn't make sense. <laughs> I'm your child. Don't you want to love your child the way they want to be loved? I don't understand. Why can't she just see me? <laughs> I'm just uh, so upset that she doesn't see me, and like I feel like if she can't see me, if my mom, all my own mom, can't see me, no one is going to see me. People like me who are trans aren't seen. Then what are we living for? I hope that by me doing, that me staying alive empowers other people, and seeing people see me empowers other people. That really keeps me going.